Hello everyone, and welcome to Stasis Bone Totem. A long time ago, when I first started the channel, uh, one of the first series I did was a little point-and-click horror game called Stasis. They were experimenting on children. Do one of these people have, like, clearance or something? Am I gonna drag them over there? Oh, oh, shit. Shit. oh fuck me. Oh, oh no, no, no. Where did my mouse go? Oh, he's dead, isn't he? Oh, he's alive. Oh, you're alive. Oh, security holograms are still working. Oh my god. Okay, great. I didn't see that coming. Sorry, give me a second. I have to find my mouse because I just flinged it off my desk. No, I'm not joking. Uh, so when I saw that the team that worked on Stasis was coming out with a sequel, I really wanted to play the demo. <laughs> so with that being said, we're just gonna get into this. And yeah, I don't know if this is related at all to the first game. I mean, it's called Stasis Bone Totem, so I assume there's some sort of connection. You'll never get to witness heaven. I've come to take you across the river into the infinite darkness to listen to the voices. Oh, what beautiful music they make. That's not ominous, but yeah. It looks like this one is uh, following the story of a couple who's working out in the ocean. So I'm trying to remember what I can about the first game, but it's been so long. I think the first one took place in space, right? Or it was set in the future? So I don't know how much of a connection there is or if there is one at all. Okay, so we're working in salvage. What the heck is that around our hand? I guess this one's in the future as well. Future sci-fi setting? Okay. Look at that man bun. That's impressive. Nothing on the AIS. Does he have a double man bun? I think he has a double man bun. That's so cool! I don't know why, but I think that's really cool. <laughs> that's really impressive. So are we looking for any salvage in particular? It seems like it. You found it! Think it's drifting! I don't know who this man is, but I love him so much already. <laughs> if anything happens to him, I will freaking lose my mind. I don't know why, but something about him. He just Wilder, seems so wholesome. Like, I don't know what I'm basing this off of, but just king, based off first impressions. <laughs> I love him. It's a king, Corp Rig. The audacity. Uh, I see a docking port up ahead. Hold on tight. I mean, if you didn't get a response, maybe it's just me knowing already this is a horror game, but if you didn't get a response, I feel like that's a clear indicator that you shouldn't board. <laughs> you know, that maybe you should just hightail it out of there. Maybe that's just me being superstitious and the whatnot, but you know, if I called someone and they didn't call back, I would not continue with the plan. I would abort the mission. Okay. Oh, ropes tied off. And the uh, rain's letting up a bit. And the foxhounds are live and sniffing. Oh, whoa. Do you think these mapping drones are worth it? Oh, well, Frankie used them on his last salvage. Saved him three days of paperwork. I still think they take away the fun of searching the unknown. Foxhound mapping network. I'm gonna head on to the lake shortly. Hey, before you head out, let me sync up quantum storage devices. Is yours active? Quantum storage device shared storage is now concurrent. What is all that? Yes, but I still can't find the spare. Oh, it's on Moses. Needed its battery. Smart. That's my girl. Okay. Who are we playing as? We're playing as the Duder. Okay. Duder. Away. Where are we going to? Oh, pile of bills on the table? Hold on, what was that about? Can I snoop? I mean, technically, it's my stuff, so I don't know if it counts as snooping if it's my stuff. A pile of unopened letters have been stacked on the table. Final notice and payment due in blaze on the envelopes. That don't sound too fun. Why are there toys in here? Sophisticated robotics kid. <laughs> Guess a forlorn figure. Patchy fur betrays its age. Mr. Kibble models boast a learning AI on par with modern alternatives. So we have kiddos? 
Okay. Or at least a kiddo? Or maybe we're into kiddo stuff. I don't know. To each their own. Disney adults are a thing, so, you know, adults should be allowed to enjoy kids' toys as well, I guess? I don't know. No, we definitely have a kid. Okay. <laughs> I don't think either of the adults are sleeping in a crib. Okay. But what was that thing? There was a thing that had a whole bunch of different, like, points on it. I don't know what that was. What is this? Is that... Is this that? Is that this? Ah, yeah, this. What does this do? What does this mean? Forward? Oh, wait, no. I want to read that. The ship's helm is a chaotic jumble of old equipment, charts, and novels. Okay. Aroma of caffeine emanates from the dashboard. Oh, huh, cool. So, green is stuff to read. What is blue? What does blue do? Can I see? Oh, wait, no. Where'd the blue go? Where's the blue? This is the blue? Right. No, no, no. Nah, these can't be right. Okay. So the blue stuff is like stuff I can interact with and it like shows me stuff? Okay. Can I look at this? Aww. Okay. What a lovely family. Wasn't there something else in here? There's the bed. I can take a power nap. Oh, wouldn't that be nice if a game had a power nap mechanic? Okay. Oh, what is that? I don't know what that is. No, wait, what is that? I don't know what that is. I want to know. Oh, is that like a battery slot? Okay. Okay, good to know. Uh, what else is there? Is there anything else? I think I got everything. I mean, there's a whole bunch of stuff to read. But we'll be here all day if we read all that. What's this? Uh, okay. What do I do with you? This is a recharge station. <laughs> it's not a good sign when I get scared by a recharge station. Oh, I got duct tape. Okay, sweet. All right. So I guess when I need to recharge stuff, I come here. Okay. And then what else is there? There's something up here. What's this? Is this to go forward? I think? I think correctly. Okay. Blue sky systems plug suit is active. All systems are nominal. I hear you. You seeing what I'm seeing? Mm-hmm. Plug suit is live. Signal is good. I don't think this was scuttled. Too much equipment left behind. I like that the face cams are so zoomed in on their face. It's like your parents trying to FaceTime you and they have like the phone like, you know, directly in front of their face and they don't know how to like, you know, hold it away from their face. Anyways, I'm gonna be relying on this ping. Like my life depends on it because it probably does. Okay. So we have a facade, we have puddles. Gonna go jump around in the puddles. Okay. Interesting, interesting. What else do we have? Cargo boxes. Okay. We have this. Whatever this is, it's very glowy. A PDA? Oh, wow. That's a lot of reading. <laughs> okay, I mean, that's not a lot of reading, but this is a lot of reading. Uh, well, if you guys want to read, feel free just to pause and read. But I want to keep things moving. Keep things a-grooving. I'm sure if there's any information I need to know, I can refer back to this later. Okay. If I get stuck, I'll read this stuff. Okay. Like, I'm assuming it just, uh, you know, syncs up with our stuff. And if not, then I know where to find it. Oh, a quarantine order. Was someone sick? Okay. 65 log entries were erased remotely. Okay. So what does that mean? If they were erased remotely? Like, someone here erased them? Or someone way off in BFE erased them, you know, through some sort of connection? I don't know, but either way, there were 65 entries we weren't allowed to know about or they didn't want anyone to know about. Whoa. Captain's wife came up from the mule in a body bag. What's the mule? Also, the captain's wife died? That's not good. Okay. I think that's the loop around. I think we've reached the loop around. Okay. So good to know that information is there. What else is around here? That's to go back down. There's something over here. Way over here we can interact with? That's a long way down. Seven 
15.5 meters. <laughs> I can make that. No, Charlie, it's too dangerous. Well, I'll find another way across. I like that the little machine, like, just, you know, reiterated our point, was like, it's actually 17.5 meters if you want to be specific. It's like, thanks, that's still, you're still proving my point. There we go, I was about to say. What's this? Is this how we get in? Do we need to yank on the chains? Do we need to cranky yank that chain? Why it doesn't look like it's spinning. Uh, explains why we didn't pick up any radio chatter. It does? Uh, could we get it running? Uh, it's behind bars right now. Well, yeah, looks intact. I'm coming up. It looks like the rain is falling up. Did anyone else notice that? We get to play as you too? Oh, sweet. Okay. Do you have different stuff? I think it's all the same stuff. It looks like all the same stuff. Mm, she really did love this old bear. Oh, she did? Past tense? That makes me a little nervous. I mean, maybe, obviously, they're not gonna have the kids with them while they're doing this kind of stuff. So maybe whoever she is, she's just waiting at home. Okay. Cool. I already messed with this. I don't know why I'm messing with it again. Um, okay. So are we just going up deep to- Deep Sea 15. Hey, ever heard of a Deep Sea designation? Nope. But there's at least 15 of them. <laughs> You're good with numbers. Okay. <sighs> looks heavy. Oh, I'll always do the heavy lifting. Open up jars, pick up boxes, lift spirits. Aww. <laughs> I love him so much! If anything happens to him, I'm going to be so upset! I guess that's on me, though. Okay, I mean, I don't know. Maybe there could be a story thing, but there better not be. The only story that better happen with him is that he gets to live happily ever after. His name is Kurt Dog. Kurt, Kurt Dog Darren. Okay. That's one heck of a name if I've ever heard a name before, and I've heard a lot of names in my life. Okay. Did we go up this way yet? I can't remember if we did. I don't know. It doesn't feel familiar. Okay, what's going on up here? No entrance this way? Okay. What is, wait, what did that say? Metastasized corrosion has eaten away at the deep C-15 signage. Well, ain't that just a shame. Par for the course, though, I guess. I don't know why I have such a southern accent today. It's because I'm still waking up. Everything is because I'm still waking up. Don't judge me. I'm usually really good about not having a southern accent. I try my best not to, you know, let it show through too much. But yeah, I guess I just, I have no filter right now. So wait, what is this? A bunch of letters? It's an informative poster. Then why the heck can't I tell what it's for? Basic information about the power distribution layout for the rig. Okay, A A F G J J A A. I'm not gonna remember that, but uh, good to know. Uh, good to know I need to refer back to that at some later point in time. I can do something with this. It's dangerous. It's the dangiest, dangerous. Ooh. Okay, sure, let's mess with it. Okay, even though it's clearly dangerous, this is a bad bit of machinery. Broken control unit. Okay. Sure. This seems legit. That's fine, I guess, if we just take that. Take a little bit of- I guess that's what we're here for, is to take a little bit of the five finger discount, but still. Okay. So what am I supposed to do with a broken piece of machinery? Regulates and integrates the operations of the door mechanism. It looks like a fuse has blown. Do we carry extra fuses? I don't know. Maybe. Possibly. Okay, where else can I go? Did I get everything up there? I hope so. If not, I'll have the duder look at it. I'll have the other guy look at it. I can go this way? Huh, ah! This. Why? I said it's not safe. Why are you doing this? Just because you can doesn't mean you should! <sighs> oh, ye of little faith. Bad idea. That's why it's a bad idea. Thank you for proving my point. Is that just gone forever? Are we just stuck here now? You are so lucky that did not happen while you were on it. I don't know meters all that well, but 17 meters is a pretty long way. I do know that. Okay. Interesting. Well, I guess now that we're over here, we may as well make ourselves comfortable. Get a feel for our surroundings. Okay. What is all this? 
I can use my technical skills to fix objects in the inventory. Two items must be in the adjacent inventory slots. So can you fix one item at a time or you need two items all the time to do the fixin'? God, you do that so fast and you constantly look like you're gonna fall over. It's making me anxious, which is probably the point, but still. I didn't realize this was a horror game because I'm gonna be terrified about your balance the whole time. Collapsed crane? Prolonged exposure to the elements has essentially entrapped the crane within a thick coating of rust. Okay. So everything's rusty, everything's dusty. Everything's groaning and a moaning as well. Uh, looks like this is the only way in. Yeah, it, it's rusted shut. What about the clearly marked door that we found earlier that we still need to figure out how to open? Are you really sure this is the only way in? On the outside window, oxidation has accumulated over time, sealing it shut. Okay. Uh, so we need to figure out a way to open it? We need something to deal with the oxidation? Are you shiny? Why are you shiny? Oh, that's why you're shiny. Twisted hinge pin. This is a heavy duty steel bar. It was jammed into the window frame. Gee, I wonder why. We'll just ignore that. Okay, it'll look great on the mantelpiece. Glad we have our priorities in order. Oh, that's right. Can I do this? Do these two things go together? Maybe? No? Okay. I mean, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what we're doing here. Like, I think we need a fuse for this. But what is this for? I don't know. It was sealing it shut, right? We still can't open it? Okay. Well, I don't really know what to do. <laughs> I'm kinda- I'm kinda stuck already. Aha! <laughs> I don't know what I did, but I did it! I straightened the hinge pin. A good weapon that'll come in handy. Oh, why would we need a weapon? Why would we need to defend ourselves? This is just a remote abandoned rig, right? Okay, well now we have that. Apparently this dude's ability is that he can use his strength to bend, break, or smash objects in the inventory. I don't know why we would need to break things, but that's an option. You're already broken, so let's not break you anymore. Okay. Uh, do you need the hinge pin, maybe? Could you, like, tap a tap -a on the glass with this? And bust it open? I mean, that wouldn't be very safe. No, okay. That's probably for the best anyways. All right, cool. So now we just have a straightened hinge pin that we can use as a weapon. I don't know what else I can do though, <laughs> you know? Like I've been switching between these two. Apparently I can switch items between them. I've been switching back and forth between them and I don't really know what else to do. Is there anything else you can do around here? I don't think so. Did you go upstairs yet? I don't think you did. Is there anything upstairs you can do? Maybe, I don't know. I guess you're not the tech person she is. Durable bunch. Yeah. yeah. Like this size, those bulkheads are magnetically sealed. So just get a bigger magnet. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how that stuff works. Okay. Like, can't we just get a super big magnet and just yank on the door? What about those things in construction that they use to lift like cars and stuff and like the, you know, the place where they smash up cars? I don't know what they're called. But can't we just get one of those and like use it against the, the door? I still want to know what this is for. I don't know what it's for. It says start push button, which I'm assuming is like the where we found the broken piece. So we need JJ for that for some reason. And then the codes for the other power stations are AA, FG, and AA. So for this one in particular, this one, it's JJ, but this is broken. So we can't do anything about that anyways. I don't know, I'm so friggin' stuck. Is there a hint system? Is there any sort of hint system? Audio input, uh, not that I'm seeing. I kind of wish the ping system had a bit of a hint system to it, you know? Like maybe if I had a certain item, something would ping a different color or something. I don't know. I'm just really stuck and it's starting to frustrate me a little bit. Oh, what? What just happened? Did that just bend back on its own? That's freaky. Why did that happen? Oh, I got a fuse. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> I just decided to retrace my steps and I was like, we haven't really used this yet. So surely it has some sort of use. 
But now this doesn't work. Okay, cool. So I guess we can't recharge any batteries. But that's fine, I guess. I mean, we only need to use this fuse on this. Oh, that's right. You can't, uh, processing. <laughs> like we only have to use this fuse on the broken control unit for a little bit. So I guess we can always pop it back out when we're done with it. But for now, I think we need to give this stuff to her. Go ahead and switch over. And then, can you fix this? I mean, you are the mechanical minded one. There we go. So surely you can fix it. If anyone can fix it, you can. Okay. Uh, Bob the Builder, fix it, Felix. They got nothing on you. Okay. Anyways, so now I think we take this up here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I put in the uh, magical letters JJ, and then maybe possibly we can open that door. That was our goal, right? Can we do that now? Way, we did it. We actually made progress, finally. I'm so happy. Oh god, I was wandering around for so long because I really didn't know what to do. I can't remember if the first game was this, you know, uh, challenging. What is this? Hmm. I'll need something to pry off this lock. Uh, too bad we lost our crowbar. Hey, that seagull was eating my sandwich. <laughs> well, now we know the unfortunate fate of one seagull. Okay, can I use this? There we go. What's that? A magnet? Sweet. Can we go use that on the other door? I just want to see real quick. Can I use this on the other door and like cancel them out? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe the force of the two opposing sides, you know, will force one side open or something. I don't know. Again, I don't know how magnets work. I don't know if you can lock pick a magnet with another magnet, but it's worth a shot. Okay. Apparently I can't do anything with that door. Heaven forbid I so much as even breathe in that door's direction. I guess I'll go in here then, since that was the goal after all. Oh, I need a cigarette. Is that bad already? We just walked in. Okay, why do you need a cigarette? Do you need a cigarette daydream? You were only 17. Sorry, now it's not the time for killer's references. Um, 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 um oh right, ping. The doy, I can ping. Turbine starter to activate the old rig turbines. A gas catalyst is used. This old mechanism powers the entire platform, which is rather remarkable. It's a little bit of a, you know, a power horse. Okay, rust away. Good to know. We can uh, get rid of rust, I guess. Oh, that has seen better days. Damaged hose. Okay, and what is this? Empty fuel cylinder. Oh, okay. Uh, right. So, using my big smart brain that I absolutely have 100% of the time, um, I'm gonna go with the very obvious answer that the duct tape and the hose should be used together. Right? And now we have a repaired hose. Okay, that's one mystery down. So we'll give that back to you. We should probably give some stuff to her. I feel bad. She's like empty handed. She's got nothing. You go ahead and take the hinge pin for self-defense. Can I go ahead and put this back? Because I know I will forget. No, I can't. Oh, I can't put it back. Okay, good. I was about to say, no one might dumb butt. I'll be like looking at this puzzle and be like, I don't understand what I'm missing. Even though I have the hose, like I'll give it to her and I'll forget I have it. Anyways, can I use the magnet on anything? A uh, nope. Nope, nope. That's the big nopers. Okay, we also have an empty fuel cylinder. Did she have anything over on her side that we could like refill the cylinder with? I don't think so. We just have that window, which maybe, I don't know. Oxidation is the same thing as like rust, right? I don't know. Maybe that'll work. Maybe. Oh my God. If this works, I'm going to feel like a freaking genius. I've been stumbling around in the freaking dark this whole time. So if this works, I'm going to be so happy because we're actually making progress. Okay. God, it was a slow burn at the start, but finally we're getting somewhere. Okay. There we go. We are in. We are in. We are in.